Aloha. Please consider the views expressed in this think tech commentary. Deer in the headlights. Wildfires are burning all over the planet. Loss of wildlife. Soaring temperatures. Floods. Droughts. And water shortages. The loss of agricultural land. Terrible human suffering. And global. Sometimes futile. Migration. For food. Security. And a decent life. Justice threatening. We have melting ice caps. Sea level rise. Coral bleaching. Biochemical degradation on land and in the ocean. The widespread extinction of species. And thus, an ominous break in the food chain. Get the idea. It's all around us. And coming closer every day. If you don't feel it yet, you will. No city. No state. No country. Can solve climate by itself. It takes all of them. And all of us. But these days we are distracted by so many other things that are forcing climate off our list of priorities. We know we have a problem. We have the science, we know what we need to do, but we are deer in the headlights. Deranged officials, insurrections, COVID, voting rights, gun control, racial and economic equality. All compelling, all troubling, but none as global and existential as climate. Congress is a casualty, and so many courts and state governments are also casualties. Who is doing anything about climate? Business still looks at the bottom line, not impact. Fossil fuels are still running things. Greenhouse gases are everywhere. Renewables and electric vehicles are not serious enough, or moving fast enough. Bills for infrastructure, with or without compromise, show that Joe Biden's heart is in the right place. But this has to be now, not decades away. It has to be full tilt, and worldwide. As with COVID, all of humanity must collaborate, and act, or soon enough we will be lost. We need government to focus, to bend every effort, and spend whatever is necessary. We are the government, and the government is us. This is still America, so, whenever you vote, vote for candidates who will take action on climate. The ones who are committed could save us, not the others. But frankly, saving ourselves is a long shot. Look at the catastrophe just outside, watch it burning, watch it coming, watch it destroying our communities and our planet. Don't be locked in the headlights. Please. Thanks. Mahalo. We appreciate your consideration of the views expressed in this think tech commentary.